So in this video, we're gonna make a tutorial how to use the mod manager from Mr. Cookie. You head over there, search for mod manager. This is that mod. I have subscribed it already, as you can see. So it will be located in this path. This path is also, is also the path of the Steam library where you have Gates of Hell installed. You, have, you can have, as you can see, many, drive, many drives and you have multiple, very multiple Steam libraries, so you have to click over there, search for local files, and you will be in the proper Steam library. Now, you have to get back over here, 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 here. here. This is the number of the gates of hell. And this is the number of the Mr. Cookie mod manager. You can see it from here. And you can copy this file, this folder to the desktop or create just the shortcut for this, only for this exe file. Yeah, so I have already did it. This is on the desktop. So when you open it for the first time, it will display this message. In, and basically this is all the instruction you have to do. So it will ask you for the mod folder. So now you have to point out the mod folder where your all mods are downloaded for the gates of hell. So this is here, here. This number is very important. This is the number of the gates of hell ID in the Steam workshop. And you got all the mods here. Select folder and now, next step is the select options file. Options file is located always in my documents, my games, gates of hell, profiles. And when you are in the profiles, this number might be different because this is the unique number of your profile in the Steam. And that's it. And you have to open mark, not uh, open, just mark the options set and open. And you got already activated mods that you have activated yourself. And you can now start changing anything. First, you got very useful, useful option. You got presets. So for example, if you play hot mod, west and cheat, you can save, save this preset. I'm going to show you. I have already did that, but I'm gonna make it once again. Where is hot mod? Hot mod West West and cheat for West. So this is your basic uh, set of mods and mod on the top is the last priority. So top priority, the mod uh, if you are activating mods inside a game, the last mod you activate is also the last mod from this list. So for my mods, this is gonna be cheat because the cheat is activated as the last mod. Now you can save this preset. So for, for example, West 81. And now you have this preset you can also create more. 
for example, I don't know, automatic, no, conquest enhanced and cheat for conquest enhanced, save mod, or, save mod order, conquest enhanced v2, you have this preset. And if you want to play your previous preset West, you have your preset. What is very important, I'm gonna choose my default preset. This is the mods I play daily. After you choose your preset, you just click save changes. And that's it. Now, the tougher part, when you choose to update your drive, when you reinstall your system, when you, I don't know, change drive letter over here, C, D, E, M, you're gonna change your name, whatever. The mod manager will probably not start. I'm gonna, just for the, just for presentation, change those names, change those patch. For any different number. Just like if you have installed new, new drive and all your data will be stored on the different partition. Mod manager will open with that error. There is no need to panic. All you have to do is to update manually these patches I have messed up already something that's normal my documents are on M I know Mods file are on D. And mod manager is launching properly. So that's it. This is really not that hard. This may look complicated, but it is really easy. And all you have to do, I'm gonna paste the video on the end, or probably it is launching right now. As I'm speaking, uh, that mod orders, mod order, is really messed up in the game manager, game mod manager built in in the game, and you have probably had crashes upon the mod activations or desync message, error message when you want to start the match with a friend in the cooperative mode. And this is probably caused by messed, ma messed up uh, mod order. What is basically happening is what you have, what you are already seeing on the screen right now. When you are activating your mods, whatever number of mods, and you close the game, you have applied them properly and all that stuff, and you close the game, and you open it later, it can have different mod order that you applied before, or some mods are not activated at all, at all. You have to remember it, because I see very often that questions that mod something, sometimes mod are not working in the cooperative. These are the probably reason. For the cooperative mode, all you have to make sure is you are using the same game version. Same game version. Right now this is 1.0390. This is the game version. Next, you have to make sure that you are using the same mod versions so if your friend asks you to, I don't know, download hot mod or anything, make sure this is updated version. 
this is really important that you are using updated versions of your mods. So if you are, I don't, I don't know how to explain this to you easier. I'm going to show you something that you probably didn't know it exists. Right here you got change logs. As you can see, hot mod is in the version 0.09b. If you are not sure if your mods are updated, go here search for the hot mod and now this the <laughs> fun begins because you have to find and identify mods <laughs> this is really where the fun begins probably easiest way is to locate them by the size or date modif modified 24 march And easiest way to find out what, which version you got is opening mod menu, mod info via, no, via notepad or anything and you got version of your mod. So your friend asks you to download hot mode, download west, download, I don't know, cheat for west and you want to play with him. You got updated the game version. You've got updated mods. Activated mods, the same as the friend told you. And you get the sync message. That means you have to not really, you don't really need to open this, but I'm gonna return to that part. Go here. Probably that's gonna blow your mind. options and see if your mods are activated the same as you did in the game menu probably those numbers will be messed up you can even activate three mods and you will see only two or one on this list this is how the game manager works in the game built in the game menu you have to really understand that this is broken, totally broken, and I have reported that issue a long time ago. It's probably not gonna be fixed. So in this case, in this scenario, always use the mod manager from the Mr. Cookie. This is the only mod manager for this game, I think. And since you create your presets, you don't have to worry to change your mods manually via options file in the my documents or anything you just open this select your own preset you have created you can also disable more delay presets i don't know if it's working or not it's probably not working but you can choose your own preset click save changes at the end and you are sure your mods are properly loaded. Now, what's the best part? Since I download this mod manager, I haven't really had uh, even once the messed up mod load order. Even once. I don't know how this uh, mod manager is doing this because I have tried make this file the options file where is it here here i have tried to make this file read only but guess what when the game opens this file will, will be hidden and next file will be created options set one or something like that if you disable Steam Cloud, because I already did it, 
because I thought that uh, this option here. This is downloading the older version of this file, op options file. This doesn't really matter if you have this marked on or off. So this is clearly the game issue. So work around. This is not a fix. Developers also, I hope the developers also will watch this video. This is not a fix. This is work around. The fix must be done by the developers of the game. So I hope everyone will understand how to properly use the mod manager. And see you in the next video. Probably. <laughs> see ya.